Hey guys, this is Ryan the Geeky V. Today I'm going to show you an add-in that I really enjoy using. It's called ASAP Utilities. That's A-S-A-P Utilities. Uh, probably the best add-in that I've found so far. It is not free. It does cost, uh, last time I checked it was around $50, but um, if you like what you see, they have a um, demo version you can use for a couple of months. Uh, see if you like it and then fork out the uh, $50 or whatever it costs. Um, I think you'll definitely like it. I actually buy this add-in for all my staff. I love it so much. Um, let me tell you, you you'll, it'll pay for itself. And one of the things I want to show you real quickly on this, um, it has its own tab here in Excel. And one of the things you can do is actually show me the time that I saved by using ASAP Utilities. And it will run a report of every single uh, function that you use in ASAP Utilities. And it will, um, so for example, here's one of the items I use, put rows together from several sheets. I use it 31 times, saved a total, um, you know, this much time, this much minutes. Um, and it adds all those together and tells you the total time, total hours that you saved. And if you put in your hourly rate, it'll tell you how much you saved. So even if you only make $10 an hour, um, you saved $55. That's it. Pays for itself. Um, so it won't take you very long to get to this level at all. So I do want to show you how you can use this tool, though, to do something um, like budgeting. Uh, it's a fantastic thing. Again, there are hundreds of things that you can do in this. I'm going to show you, show you just a few um, directly related to building a budget. So the first thing you would do is um, you have a list of all your departments, and you want to create a different, a separate tab for each department. So departments 1 through 30. I'm going to highlight those, and I would go to Sheets and insert multiple sheets using the cell values as sheet names. I click OK. And here just gives me a little um, tool tip. How do I want to have this done? I'll click OK. And then automatically you can see down below how I have a different tab for every single department. So far so good. Then the next step I want to do is make sure I have this information. Actually, let me delete this. I have a blank um, budget here. So different expense categories, um, 12 months. And I want this to be in every single sheet. So let me just copy that. We come down to department one. And then we hold the shift key, select department 30, and then control V. And then it shows up for every single department. Now that I've done that, I've created a tab with the ba basically the template for everybody to fill in for every department. I want to actually export this. So each department has a different manager over it, and I want to have a different worksheet sent to each department. So instead of saving this 30 times and, and deleting the non-used tabs, I can just export each of these sheets to an individual workbook. To do that, you go to Export, and then Export Worksheets as Separate Files. I'm going to export everything but these first two. So the rest of them, I'll browse, find a spot. OK, so now if I open up that folder that I just exported to, you can see a file, a separate file for each one of those worksheets. Let's just open up one, Department 4, for example. And there you go. It's just one tab, Department 4, nothing else to it. 
department manager just has to go in here and insert their budget information. Once that's done, they can save. And then you're ready to import. So I already went through this and created some files with information in it already. So what we want to do now is, you know, imagine every single uh, manager has gone out there, they've entered all their information, and you've got maybe 50 different um, rows, okay? How do you get all that together? Well, you go to ASAP Utilities, and now you're going to the Import function, and you're going to Merge and or Import Multiple Files. It's all Excel in the workbook. I'm going to create a new worksheet for each file. Click OK. This time I've got 50 files I'm going to import. I click Open. And while this is working, I want to show you real quickly. We're starting with Sheet 1. And here in a second, you're going to see a sheet for every single department. Okay, department 9, 8, and so forth, all the way through department 50. So I've got all of them, a separate tab for each one of them. The last thing I want to do is combine all these together. So I need to find a way in each of these tabs to enter the department name. So if I just select this section right here, I'm going to have every tab put the department name. So I've got department 9 down here. That's the tab name. I want it to show up right here. And you'll see why we want to do this in just a second. I go to Sheets, and then Insert Sheet Name in Selected Cells. Oh, actually, I made a slight mistake. I need to also make sure I select every single department tab. So 1 through 50. Go back up. Sheets. Insert sheet name in selected cells. I wanted to put it in those cells on each of the selected 50 sheets. OK. And there you see I have department 9. If I go to department 7, department 7, and so forth. Now the reason why I did that is because I want to be able to go in and combine all of these into one big sheet. So once again, I highlight the rows now. Sheets. And down here, number 23, put together rows or columns from several sheets. I click that. Okay, we're going to name this the All Sheet. So now I can go ahead and fill in the information. This is January to December. And then the department name. And there you have, you have the entire, everything put together in one large sheet. So that works out pretty well. That's one of the best things about the ASAP Utilities. Uh, doing this before ASAP Utilities required a lot of copying and pasting, saving different files, um, and it was just a pain in the butt. It would just take hours upon hours to do this. Um, even with the, you know, the, the right clicking or control V and control C and the, shortcuts um, it still took a lot of time with asap utilities i find that it takes me you know a matter of maybe five minutes to not only create a template to export it so everybody has access to it but then to import it and then combine all the responses into one single file so anyways there's a lot of other things you can do with asap utilities uh, i happen to think that this is one of the best uses for it is creating a budget uh, and I'd like to know if you could in the comments, if you do make a comment, just let me know what kind of add-ins you use and you find useful. Hopefully you found this video of value. We'll see you next time.